train the muscles, not the joints. Okay, so welcome back to Natural Gland Bodybuilding. And don't worry, I'm not glaring at you. It's just the sun is in my eyes and uh, yeah, there's not really much shade or good lighting around here, but I like this field. It's just nice and it's sunny out. So it's good to be in the sun. And if the camera shakes, it's just because my cat keeps on jumping on the freaking tripod. So yeah, it's not my fault. Bad cameraman, bad. Anyway, uh, today I thought I'd talk to you just about one thing, okay? Uh, I've had some people email me about the programs that I wrote on my website, okay? And again, the programs are just based on my own experience of what worked for me over the years. So I thought I'd share uh, these structures in the form of programs because my YouTube videos are a lot about just showing you how to adjust different parameters and reps and all this kind of stuff. But sometimes it really helps to start with a template. So I've made these templates available for you guys on my website in PDF form. So the thing is that what is in the PDFs? Because some people are asking me, like Jason, what's really outlined in there? What, what do you give us? What, what is, what's it all about? What's, what's the program? Stop that. Stop jumping on the tripod. Yeah, I know you're, whatever it is is going on, just get off the tripod. Anyway, okay, I'm back. All right, so anyway, so some of these people are asking me, what is in the programs? What does it contain? You know, what's it consist of? The programs outline your sets, your reps, and your rest time, and your frequency throughout the week. Get off the tripod, get. <laughs> I tell you, that cat is just driving me nuts. I don't know what the heck <laughs> Anyway, so sets, reps, and rest time in between sets. That's what the programs consist of. Also, there are recommendations based on how you feel. So say, if you feel like you're getting burned out, to take an extra day off. Usually there's a day off a week or two days off, depending on which program you purchase. And if you purchase the whole body workout three days a week, obviously that's just a three day a week workout. So you have four days off, but three days you're actually training, right? Now I will have, and I know I've talked about this for the last month or so, I will have three day splits available on my site at some point. So when I refer to a split, just so you guys know, cause I know not everybody's clear on this. A split means that uh, if it's a two day split, that means your full body is split into two different days. Now, how many days you train per week is also outlined in the program. One day will have half your body and then the other day will have the other half. Now in a three day split, that means your body is split into three different days. You know, so say Monday you do, you know, one or two body parts and Tuesday another couple body parts and then Wednesday you would finish off the whole body with the entire, you know, the rest of the body parts that are, well, whatever body parts you have left. Yeah, that's what you finish off with. So anyway, that's a three day split. You split the body into three different days. Four day split. I think you get the idea. It's, this is what it's about. Some people are asking me about splits. They don't really understand what split means. So if you guys have questions about this, now I've answered it. There you go. Good, nice nice and simple. Now, as far as warmups, for warmups, I always ride the bike for five or 10 minutes if I feel like I need to. And I always recommend for people to do this, to ride the bike, something low impact, just to get the blood flowing. I recommend people do that. Although you'll see that I very rarely do this. What I do is I usually just do lightweight for several sets and sometimes it's four or five sets until I feel like the blood is in the area, the stretch is there and everything's limber and it feels like it can move. So once I've heated the area up with the actual exercise that I want to perform, then I basically move up in weight. For bench press, this would look like just some bench presses with the bar. So then I'm laying there for a bit, looking like I'm taking a nap, just stretching out with the bar. Then I'll go to a plate aside, rep out for 30 or 40 reps just to get the blood flowing, get a little bit of a burn in there. rest for a couple minutes, just stretch a bit, and then I move up and wait. Or I stay at one plate. Say I feel real tweaky that day or I feel real tight or something. Mm -hmm. 
then I might continue to do multiple sets with that same weight until I feel comfortable that my body feels loose enough and feels warm enough for me to move up, okay? And then when I move up to 225, I decide do I wanna go beyond that or not, then I'll just put another plate on, so I'm 225, do some reps with that, 20 reps or whatever, and then I'm saying, okay, do I wanna go heavier today or not? But that's usually what I start with. I start with about three, four, five sets of warm up, and then I move into my actual work weight. One mistake that I made when I was younger is that I would do just a couple warm up sets, but I wouldn't gauge how many warm up sets I did based on how I felt. Sometimes I would just say, okay, this is a standard format. One warm up set, then two warm up set, then boom, into the heavy weight. And I wouldn't actually make decisions based on how I felt. Because some days you feel tighter than others. Some days you feel more sore than others. Some days different things are going on with your body. So it's important to gauge that. So basically I outlined this in the program as well to basically do uh, your warm up with your cardio first. Make sure your blood's going. And then I recommend that you do several warm up sets before any exercise that you perform, okay? So it might be four or five if you need it, or a couple, it depends on you, right? But I definitely recommend two to three, four warm up sets, just nice and easy, just to get the joints moving, get everything moving, and then move into your work weight. So I hope this answers a couple of the questions I've been getting for this last day or so, and it helps you understand kind of what you're getting when you do purchase a, a program from my website. You are getting the sets, reps, rest time, and you're getting the exact exercises, all that kind of stuff. And in some cases, you're actually getting links to YouTube videos that have the exercise that I'm talking about in the program, okay? In the future, I may include some sort of video clips in there as well, but at this point, it seems like uh, redundant because I'm already giving you the video clips on the YouTube channel, and I'm assuming that you're watching every one of my videos and learning, you know, what's the point of me putting it in the program, right? Because you're already watching. You're already watching all these videos. So anyway, I hope this helps you out, and uh, thanks a lot for watching, and take care for now. <laughs>